Hi, growing family on a budget here. So I've just completed the weekly shop and I thought I'd just video what we've got to show you. So my family's been sick for near on two weeks with um, the flu and I'm the latest casualty. I went through a whole box of these tissues yesterday by myself. So I thought I should grab another box for the next person who decides that they're going to be sick. I was almost out of tea bags. And um, a 100 pack of these are $5 at Woolworths. And the 200 pack was $6.50. So I grabbed the 200 pack. I've got 12 cartons of full cream milk. We don't use fresh milk. We just use the, the carton stuff. Um, and we also use it to make our homemade yogurt. That way I don't have to boil the milk. I got some light milk, so I'm trying to shift a couple of kilos from having my youngest. So I thought that will help when I'm cooking or my tea. Um, I grabbed a water bottle from Aldi today. So these, I don't know how much is in, how much it takes. Uh, 828 mils. So that's a pretty big water bottle. Uh, it was $6.99. I was pretty happy with that. It's got a little um, ice cooler that you can put in it. Um, so Woolworths had Head and Shoulders on sale for half price, this size, the big size. Um, I just use whichever one. It doesn't really matter what it says on there. They all do pretty much the same thing. Um, so that was $8. Um, some pads. So these are from Coles. They were $3 for a pack. So I bought two to stock up. Oh, sorry, I dropped something. Um, from Coles, these were half price. So they're taco and chipotle seasoning packs for 84 cents. So I grabbed a few of those to have in the cupboard. We're also having burritos tonight, so I'm going to be using one of the seasonings with half price tortillas. So 12 packs were half price. There were only three left in the store, so I grabbed all three. Um, they were $2.07 for a pack, which is actually cheaper than the store brand. Um, some paper towels, some toilet paper, um, some honey wheats. Well, they're the Woolworths brand of honey wheats. They actually have less sugar in them, and they're only $2 a bag. And same with the rice bubbles. So rice bubbles are rice bubbles. Kids don't seem to care. Um, some light cream cheese, so I use that on lots of things, make it dip, so I use it with some pretzels, put it on bread, um, use it in cooking, it's really versatile. Some light cheese, so we've got full fat cheese, um, the, the little ones don't have anything light, you have to give your children um, full fat for the nutrition, but I grabbed a pack for me, I'm going to keep this in the freezer because um, it's got less fat and less kilojoules than full fat cheese. Uh, grab some more bananas. They're great in smoothies. They're great for the kids. They're good to just grab on the way out of the house. Some sour cream for our burritos tonight. Some bacon, because you can never have too much bacon. Um, I went shopping with a two-year-old and he put these in the trolley. So I guess these are dessert for... Three, three of our people, the little one and uh, my daughter and my husband. Um, we love this jam. It's a really, really expensive jam. It's four dollars for that small jar, um, and they're on sale for three dollars for a jar. So I grabbed two of those at Coles. So they will go onto the sh um, stockpile shelves. And I also grabbed some of these. These um, are curry bases. I usually make curries from scratch just using Keen's curry powder and vegetables and some other spices and then usually some um, coconut milk. But these were only I think it was two dollars and fifteen cents and I thought I would give it give it a go. Um, we don't like spicy so I chose the ones that only had one little chili on the front here. Um, the butter chicken actually only has half a little chili on the front here. So, um, my husband does not eat curry at all. I'm just hoping to make these into pretty much just vegetable curries to have on 
cauliflower rice and probably do up a bunch of them and put them in the freezer for lunches or dinners when he's not home. And then I got Coke, which was cheapest at Coles this week. Um, it came to a dollar fourteen per litre compared to the special that Woolworths was having, which was a dollar twenty-five per litre. So all of this uh, we got from Aldi, Woolworths, and Coles, which are all relatively close to each other. Um, our Aldi and Woolworths are actually in the same shopping place, so. Um, it's convenient to be able to stop and get whatever is on special at whichever shop because Coles is actually on the way home from Aldi and Woolworths. And I spent $105. Okay, um, I'll be putting up some pictures of what we use this stuff on on my Instagram. If you're interested in our next shopping haul or our videos on our budgeting, please subscribe. And if you have any questions, leave them below. Thanks.